Hello, beautiful people. It's Gifty, the gift to your hair, and you're in for an amazing transformation. This is a how to install a blonde wig on head. So to begin, I apply the wig on my client's head. I do use a little bit of makeup just to color correct the lace. It is transparent lace, so it comes super white, but this lace blended flawlessly. After doing that, I go ahead and apply at least two layers of lace glue to the skin, not the hair, but to the skin, and I make sure I spread that thin so that it dries clear. Once it dries clear, then you can proceed on. I use about two to three layers first before putting this on I did saturate the skin with alcohol to make sure the skin was prepped before going in with the glue once I get done with that process I then start off by cutting the lace using a scissors and I'm cutting the lace right in between then I'm gonna take a razor blade and now go through and cut the lace even more to match like her hairline first i start off with the scissors just to like you know have a beginning guide then i go in with the razor to create more detailed cutting to mimic her own natural hairline so y'all it's been a while since i've been on youtube because i have been planning working on my valentine's day special things are going really good right now i'm about to drop the gift sets so definitely check out my website which is gifty.org and also check out my instagram which is underscore g-i-i-f-t-i -I -I gifty for all the amazing february releases i've been doing this is one of the february valentine release wig actually that is our cool sweet blonde this is our cool sweet blonde it has just medium dark like ash darkish brown roots and then the rest of the hair is this beautiful cool blonde color it's not really ashy but it's not like you know yellow it's a nice cool clean blonde with light dark roots so this is one of the wig in our valentine's collection release definitely check it out if you haven't yet and let me know what you think right now i am simply going over and color correcting the top of the lace i did the bottom and what what i mean by color correcting i'm using a either foundation a tint that matches my my client complexion and i'm going through and then tinting the white transparent lace to be even more to her skin once i do the tinting i go back over using a little bit of glue and lifting up the front part to make sure i get the little little front hairline to just blend into the skin this part is so crucial you do want to go over that hairline one more time after I do that, I proceed put to putting on a band and I do pop my client under the dryer for about 20 minutes so that everything can melt and look amazing. Once she comes out of the dryer, this is the look. Tell me, this is not fire. Like the hairline melted flawlessly. This is only transparent lace, amazing. Transparent lace is white, so you can color blend to any skin tone. So if you're a light skin, this lace is great for you. It's really durable. It can last a long, long time. The wig itself can last up to three years. This install that we did can last about two to three weeks, and then she either can come back in for a reinstallment, or she can start doing it herself. The wigs are very easy to maintain and easy to work with. This hair, it is is a frontal so you can do many cute styles with it like the half up half down you can make it straight like the hair right now is in the straight um middle part you can pull it up into a half up half down and i will proceed to styling this wig into beautiful body wave curls like just to add something mind you my client turned 32 this was this was her 32 birthday hair so we wanted to do something different like she is oh, she's so funny um originally we did a different wig and then she came in and she seen this blonde wig she's like no 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 i want this one i want this one i'm like girl whatever you want is your birthday so we changed up the wig and we did this and i think this looks amazing and beautiful on her right now i'm proceeding to do the baby hair we're just doing some light too simple baby hair like we don't want nothing too extra because the blonde the blonde is given, okay? It's giving what it needs to give, so you don't want to do too much with anything else. Um, now I'm just using my curling barrel. I use the medium size barrel 
to create these beautiful body wave curls on this soft cool blonde like this blonde is so beautiful y'all it turned out perfect if you're looking for that perfect blonde with a little bit of dark roots definitely check out the description box the link will be in the description box for this wig you can get this wig now 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 the whole month of february i have amazing deals for you and now it's time for the review y'all look at that look at that look at that i Yes, this is so beautiful. This is one of my, like, I love this hair. I need to make myself a blonde wig just like this because that's how much I love this hair. This hair was fantastic. The install looks great. She looks happy. Not mean she looks happy. She was happy. Um, She went on her vacation for her birthday, and I was just so pleased to be able to do her hair. But this is the end of the video, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. This is Gifty, the gift to your hair, and I am back. I am sorry for staying so 